Last year, I had to deal with one of the hardest crashes in kiteboarding history. The 2016 Red Bull King of the Air. Oh my Holy god! Shit. The heat has been stopped. The rider's safety is imperative. I got knocked out on the water and my lungs were filled with salt sea water. Let's give a round of applause, everybody. The King of the Air 2016 was ever for me. I spent almost a week in the hospital to clear up my lungs and fully recovered after six months. I still like to believe that if the crash never happened, I would have made it to the podium. However, I'm up against reality. Time to get myself ready again. Damn, Cape Town offers me the best big air training conditions. I'm ready for it. Let's see how it goes. The world's most extreme kiteboarding event. This is gonna get radical. Let's get ready. And here we go, Lasso Walker. Smash oh, the mega lead with a light backflip. That's Lasso Walker. Give it away to the crowd. Big mega lead. Put in the jump. Drops in across the base. And a one booty mega lead from Lasso. I made it to the semi finals and faced my teammate Aaron Hadlow. Here we go then, Lasso walk on the inside, Aaron Hadlow on the outside. This time for the Megaloop KGB. Oh, he's gone for it! Oh! Ruthless execution from Aaron Hadlow. Lasso knew that that move was just too much. For real? Again? I just couldn't get the height and extremity to perform as I needed. Getting up on this podium is something I've been dreaming of since the day I started kiteboarding. And I believe there's only one way of getting there. It's by fully enjoying every chance you get. When you start living the life of your dreams, there will always be obstacles and setbacks along the way. But if you go out and do what you have to do, and what you love, there's no limit to what you can achieve. My name is Lasse Walker, and I'm a professional kiteboarder.